Oh, he's having it. He's having a panic attack. Wow. 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 Yeah, yeah. He pulled you off. Yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. Wow. You're sitting outside your house. <laughs> Daughter's going back to school. Tall, Tall belt. belt. school belt. <laughs> that was a long time ago, wasn't it? They absolute legends. <laughs> Let's have a look. We've the got delivery. food on the platter. Oh, oh with Jazza. When he ate the burgers. <laughs> Did you see that? Oh, Have you seen that, Sam? The uh, coffee shop, Oliver Alma. Our mate Chaz on Scatwood, our Chaz on Real Talks, he, we oh, give him bulk like food the food. The bulk car. With tomato sauce. Yeah. I'll follow the oh, luck, mate. Right. And him, you, you Sam. Like he would even right. turn his nose up at Did he know? Yeah. Oh, Chaz ate the whole lot. Yeah. He ate the whole lot, mate. Yeah, no, he done the lot, mate. He, and, and the hot chilli challenge. He does it all, mate. He yeah. done the, the, the well stinkiest fish. Yeah, and he's the only oh, man yeah. I know to actually eat oh, and drink Oh, mate, that was minging. You open the tin and everyone throws up instantly. It's horrible. I think he's had so many fights, his nose, he's got no senses. Come down and have a look at his staff. Yeah, before we start, take a, Come on. Take a picture of Brad and the boys. Oh. Look at oh, all, mate. You stand the camera. Cheers, bro. Jimmy. How's radio? Oh uh, yeah, FIX Radio! You can WhatsApp us on 07392 014 964. How are you feeling this morning? I'm tired, bruv. <laughs> are you tired? I woke up, I didn't even know where I was. I was <laughs> I'm actually vibing. We are having delivered all of my cornice and ceiling roses from Plaster Ceilings, uh, PlasterCeilingRoses.co.uk. PlasterCeilingRoses.com, sorry. PlasterCeilingRoses.com. So I've got my ceiling roses from my house, top and bottom, and all of the cornice, and I'll show you the Ooh. profiles that I've chucked. Oh, it's unbelievable, mate. Mate, it's unbelievable. It's you showed so me the nice. sample. The sample's lovely. They sent the samples to me. And there was swift delivery as well. Sent the sample straight out and then re chose out of four. So we chose two one for upstairs, one for downstairs. And then we chose um, two different style roses as well one for upstairs, one for downstairs. And this stuff's this stuff special made, you know. They, they, they run it off molds and stuff like that. But they stock it. They've got, they got loads of stock of all of the popular stuff, I guess. I'm buzzing for it. I can't wait to see it. And I've got a geezer called Mutley. Big George's mate, they call him Mutley. He's about this big, and Big George's like that. They used to go to school together. <laughs> and Mutley fitted all of this cornice from these boys as well in Big George's house. That's so a cool name, that's isn't it? Mutley's yeah. wicked, isn't it? Sick name. It's probably how he laughs. I call Sam Mutley sometimes, don't I? Yeah. That's how he laughs. What, why? What's Mutley mean? Mutley's a dog out of a TV program, a kids' children program. Oh. <laughs> Is that all mine? That's all yours. Is it? <laughs> There's some gear there, isn't there? You got 11 ceiling roses. 11, 11, and, not 13. Uh, 40, uh, 90, 90 meters of each. Of each. Of each. Of each. Yeah. He's eating. <laughs> he just moved my bag and nicked the muffin, yeah. bro. He nicked the muffin. He liked muffin. Why did you eat the top, side? though? Oh, look at that, Eve. Come wow. on, we're open one up. I'll get that out in a minute. No, that's for upstairs. That's wow. the upstairs profile. They're the ceiling roses, Sam, for the gaff, right? They've come on this website, plasterceilingroses.com. I was just saying to Eve on that camera, Big George. Ah, uh, yeah. He's mate from school, Mutley. Do you know Mutley the installer? I know Mutley. Right, so Big Jules knows Mutley. He went to school with Mutley. He put him onto me. Mutley put me onto you boys, and we've made it happen. All this stuff a couple days ago. He left it perfect timing. I left timing. it at nine o'clock so that you had about 15 <laughs> minutes break. <laughs> he did. I said, look, I can't take up delivery until after nine because of the radio. So he's come for me. These are unbelievable. If you hold them side on, like, like that, that because yeah. obviously the strength the is in the board yeah. otherwise if you hold them flat Snap. they can crack Snap. but i think what he's done is he's given you a couple of extra lengths in each pack yeah just in case you might have an odd little might yeah. just a little chip on the knee or you. something i'm with you to make it right but mutley i've been told is the number one fitter in the country that's what he told me that's coming from him himself isn't it but <laughs> i can't tell you how excited i am for these i mean look at the detail This is the bee's knees. Downstairs one. But it's getting them fitted right as well, you know. You, I mean, a lot of places got them that. Yeah. They screw these up. They screw them up as well. They screw. That's what they do, they screw them up, don't they? You'd be surprised how many people get it wrong. We even do like the, just the outer rings. 
Yeah. Like that, it's just like yeah. a ring that goes round it's it like, again, so you like a, and we do dado rails. You saying they go massive, what? Like, yeah, yeah, we got all different sizes. The workshop is completely full of different products. We have to come down to the workshop. Yeah, that, I want to see that. Yeah, that'd be unreal. It's only local, wouldn't you? Ford, Ford yeah. Bradford Industrial Estate, Building do, X2. Do they do they manufacture it in that one, or do they manufacture it in a different It's manufactured up the north, Yeah, and, and then, then we down. get shipments down, and then we place it all in different skillets and piles in the workshop. It's all laid out in different piles. That's oh, nice, sweet. a bit more simpler for the bedrooms. So yeah, you're more than welcome to pop yeah. in. Simpler upstairs there yeah. for the bedrooms. Um, and I've got one of them, I believe, for the upstairs landing as well. Because nice. you're going to have a chandelier coming down on that. But they're subtle, aren't they, for there? And then I'll show you some of that stuff as well. Buzzing for that, mate. Never, ever, ever. I used to think when I was at college, I learned a little bit of running the moulds, plaster by trade. Only a couple of about two months ago for running moulds. So I get how much goes into the detail in that. It's getting the moulds right and whatever else. Never owned a house with that in. Buzzing to put that in this house, man. That is level, mate. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. You're very welcome, bro. That's lovely. It's a bit buzzing to have done this. Oh, yeah. yeah. I appreciate it. Come yesterday as well. You know, have you heard of the bold builders? I said they're legends, mate. That's it, legends. I would love to meet them. There you go. We're real. Yeah, every time I, I sort of like miss you, you sort of like, Jimmy. Yeah. I love the, I like the dog burger one. I think Ethan should eat the dog burgers. The dog I burgers. Don't. Would you eat them? No. Would you eat everything? Nah. No, but that was He's done the chili food, challenge, no, the chili chip challenge, but the best one is sending your, your daughter off to school with a tool belt. As a <laughs> <laughs> you mentioned that the other day, didn't you? <laughs> Rulers, pens, mate. Tool so, belt to school belt, see you later. She walked off, she went, mm. BMM. <laughs> nice one, brother. Thank you very much. Appreciate you, Keith. Have a good one, yeah? Have a good one. We'll go back to work. See you, lads. See you later, mate. Thank good you. To meet you. Cheers, mate. 100% hey, he's gonna bark. Right. When I start talking, he'll start barking. <laughs> right. But that's quite right. funny. If it happens, it happens. Cause cause bring, it, bring your dog to work day. I've got my dog with me. <laughs> yeah. they, uh, don't mention it unless he says yeah, 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 yeah. Unless, unless he says, unless he says, yeah. says anything. <laughs> like, Jimmy, Jimmy, what's your really problem? Yeah. <laughs> do they do, because what happens is they blow out your garden, your next door neighbour has a chore up. Yeah. Gone! <laughs> All of a sudden they've got a trampoline. Possessions nine tenths of the law, so if it lands in the next door neighbour's garden, they all own it. Well done, Ed and Mike and Mickey <laughs> and Joanne, and we are going to do it all again tomorrow. And in a minute, we're talking tattoo stories yes. on Ball Banner. I'll show you mine, you show me yours. That link to do, that link to do, that is that link. This is our paperwork piece, this is how we do it, mate. Mm. So we get paperwork and... Um... Was that last line scripted? Or was that off the cuff? What's that? Show it. You show me yours, I'll show you mine. Off the cuff, yeah. That's none of that script. So, <laughs> so, so I know it's all right in there, but what this is, that link there was WTF. And throughout the show, we're out in the morning already, we've, we've punted for answers from the listeners. So then we send them in, and obviously these are live You're answers. You're listening right? to so Brad and Sam, it's just gone off. And then we read them out now on the hour, there and then. Um, so, and then all that's off the cuff, you just do that. You just take that as your guideline, and then you just play around. Mm. Just let it come out, yeah. I don't know if the uh, viewers got all that. I think you just talked over yourself on, on the headphones. Huh? <laughs> Sorry. No, I think yeah, you just talked just over yourself on the up. headphones. Did I? Because <laughs> of that there. Someone no, said something. That was my me. fault. Oh, oh is that right. Jack? That's all right, Jack no. playing around. That's Jack on there. That's Jack playing around now. Sorry. This is, this is how it works. <laughs> this is how it works, guys. He was very impressed, actually. This is how I record the audio, boys. <laughs> is, it, is that how it works? Yeah. yeah. That's well technical, that. <laughs> 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 Hello, Mark. How are you? Oh, I'm wonderful. Thank you very much. Ooh, look at these. <laughs> They're proper, aren't they? Proper what? Dolls. Uh, it just blocks it. Yeah. Come on, you boy. Come on, geese. Why do you have to get me when I've got a dodgy face carrying shit? I spoke to you yesterday. We were talking about the pub and that. And he didn't say nothing. So I thought maybe he didn't realise he was. Hello, mate. Hello. No, it's my school bag. Oh, all right. It's a school, school day, mate. School trip today. Every day's a school day. Every day's a school day. master. I am the teacher. Oh, well. I've got an apprentice today, and all. Have you got? Oh, yeah. Calvin. What? The ladies, you've got to come out of the quarter, dude, and say I'm barking in my plumber. <laughs> 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 no, you got to. 
You lost giving it the big one, so well, you're better looking than Calvin. Who said that? You said that. I didn't say that. I didn't say that. I got you, low self-esteem. You two were right. having that conversation. I, I got a low self-esteem, mate. Right? I wouldn't have said that. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Yeah. He literally said he's the best looking plumber in Sussex. <laughs> well, I am. Have you seen the state of most of them? <laughs> Normally fat and crippled. Sam, I think it might be that time again. It's time to wind up the Sparky. Figuring out beds. I think they put the sockets in the wrong wrong place for the bed. I don't know. What's the king oh, bed? Five foot. Five foot. And what's the double? Double is the one, isn't it? I don't know, I just, yeah. Double's four six. Four six, yeah, so it's not much difference, yeah. And what's a small double? Small double's four. And a single? Single is three foot. And what we're putting in here? King. And you what have you mapped out for? The king. Oh, we're right then. What am I? Surely we can't yeah. get him twice, can we? Right. Is that all right, yeah? Well, he's still still live for a minute, so we'll go straight up there. Does it not to be hard wired in on, I think, no? Yeah, it will be eventually. Eventually, once we touch up all the fuse boards, you'll have, you'll have sockets and everything in here for gotcha. all this separately. But for now, if this can be fired up and get some radiators going, then we can just... Just go on that. Not have to be hard wired in, no, OK. For now, I believe so, yeah. For sure. Yeah, well, I can bring my boss Trev later. Trev's the one, Trev's the one that does it all. Yeah, so, maybe. Like, my partner then. <laughs> 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 I don't know who you are, you're serious to me, man. I don't know, you're just here with a white one. I don't know, I'm just here with a white one. 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 I voice noted Dave this morning. I sent him the commentating thing, you know, when they're like selling things in an auction. I said, that's what you were like talking like, to him like, oh, mate. He's 100 miles an hour, he's quality. He's like, right, I'm going to yeah, switch their socket there, and then we run a cable up there, chase up there, yeah, Paul, God damn it, mate, 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 mate. Brilliant. Right, I'm going to get in there, and I'm going to glue up, clean all that shit up, because today, Hook, line, sink up. we are one, one skim gym back. Uh -oh. One skim, but he's going to do two skim today, so he's going he's gonna to double coat it. Right, you boys. Today, now. Anything you say, I'm not believing nothing now. At least you're up here, I'll be like, no, I'm not moving. No, I ain't doing it. No, I'm lying. <laughs> He's lying. <laughs> we need water for what we have to ask next door. Well done, mate. Calvin. Tomorrow. You know what that's for? No. They're going to resin fix in my wall plate when they do my lean-to roof tomorrow. Yeah. And when they drill out the hole, this just blows the dust out of it, so the resin sticks. So all that is is like a pump, like a foot pump. That's it. And then it all does, it blows the dust out of the hole. It's like a tonic, but the other way around. Cal, first job, mate, could you, because you're the plumber today, and you're with Barney. Can you put the electric on? Because <laughs> you're the plumber today, and you're with Barney, Barney's disconnected all that water. Can you just run next door and just ask if I can have a lend up on our own pipe for, for the morning? A few moments later. What neighbour? He's just knocked at the wrong neighbour. No, he hasn't. He knocked over there. What? Silly goose. I, I don't think, think he has. Think he has. That house is so far away compared to that one. Why has he done that? The rolling thunder. I'm quiet, mate. Can't see near me coming. This is a rarity, mate. Me using dust sheets with the cameras on. I'll make it look proper now, mate. Yeah, you've got to make it look like I'm doing a proper job. Do you want me to put these over your clothes, Brad? Are they not going to get. No, that's their new sheets, they must. Yeah. I've got a mission day that day in there. You've got to skim all that out, all that out, mate. When I passed, I like to start by seven o'clock. Well, so you can have your normal, normal plaster times would be done by two. No, I was always, well, you have a gauge, innit? A gauge of plaster is like three hours. So I'm gonna have to try and keep moving and get that on in one hit. One skim? Yeah, but I ain't fast no more. <laughs> I ain't got the speed I used to when I was younger. Throw it on, mate. 100 meters a day, bruv. Used to set 100 meters a day, set. 50 floating set. Hard worn skin on site. 50, that's a lot of square meters, mate. For me, I'd be lucky to do 30. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're taking that off. I think so. There'll be no beans in there, wouldn't there? It'll be upright. It's upright, yeah, it's built in it. That's this timber frame, man. And <clears throat> the only thing is, we're going to go skirting as well, or we just yeah. try and leave the skirting on. No, leave, try and leave the skirting on. I'd multi tool that, mate. Yeah, just multi tool the edge and yeah. pull it out.
shorter out of you two. Him. Yeah. No way. You are. Take your hat off. Hat off. Put it down. Oh, mate. That's quite, like bang on. I think he's quite close. That's really close. I actually don't know. I'll leave that in the comments. What are you doing, Sam? Reading uh, uh, how to do it. <laughs> but do you know what, right? Yep. This used to be about £4.50 plus that bag. It's a tenner including that. No. £10, bro. Put 10 quid. 60 quid there. Shh. 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 <laughs> so the blast was made for plaster. Yeah. These, so they're here, you ain't got PVA here, but you've got PVA here. Yeah. And that will help control the suction, the PVA glue, so it don't draw in too much. Because these are dry walls, it draws the moisture out of the plaster so right. quickly, it won't allow it time to set properly and it just craze and crack and fall off. So it helps two things, it helps to stick the plaster to the wall, but also control the suction of the plaster as well that you put on the wall. Before Hamilton even started to play around with us and get us to do content for him, I always use these brushes. These ones. Always use that angle brush because when you plaster him, great for cutting in angles. And when you get around little bits like that, just touching up things and then coming around and getting your brushes in. Always use it before they even started to pay me to tell you how great their product is. I was using it anyway. But the product is good, so go and buy one. So I can't believe Barnes got Calvin sweeping up already. Yeah? <laughs> Bones bitched him, bruv. Get that clearing up. Not my wife does to me every night like that. Calvin's Barney Rumble. I am my wife's bitch through and through, mate. I think we all are. You're married, you'll know what I'm talking about. You want to scrim up after you glued. Because when you glue, the water and the glue lifts the scrim tape off the wall and it just falls back off. So now that's gone off a little bit, the scrim tape sticks to that lovely. They're the little tricks. You don't know until you try it. Mm. These are the little things, man. If you're going to start doing a little bit of plaster on your doors. That's what's worth it, weight and bone. Yeah, because if you, 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 that fall, you'd have scrimmed up that and fell on the floor again. Why did it fall off? Because this is self adhesive, so it's got glue on the back of it. We're going to leave that bit off and that seal off because that's coming out. Fingers crossed tomorrow, Barney might have had a second hand tank for me from the motion heater. Yeah. If he's done that, then my hot water's come, that should come out. So that'll be a Saturday job maybe. And um, yeah, the rest of it's gonna get skinned. Yeah. Right, knock up, I reckon, two, one bucket. Yeah. Let's get it on and then another bucket. When you're, when you're doing this as well, Eve, it's all about wetting your tools when you're plastering. Hello darling, you all right, you feel better? Feel shit, you look shit, mate. Oh no, you bought me. Why aren't you going like this? I've been laying down all day. I know, but that's, that's if you're ill, you've got to rest in it. So we're plastering, it's all about wetting your tools, making sure they're wet, so the gear don't dry when it hits it. That's all. Oh, yeah, we are, Sparky, you your voice out with me. Me and Daniel are just dropping the witterings at the minute, right? We are working on the f***ing clappers. That's probably worth about three million quid. Just rush back to your gaff to be part of this f***ing act this afternoon. <laughs> him, no. him and Daniel are working at the Rick witterings. He said we're working on the f***ing clappers to get back here on a wind up. <laughs> <laughs> Go up to your bedroom, we're about to take where the uh, rad's coming under the window. It's, we're about to take the section out, timber it, insulate it and board it. Barn's on the case, I've sheeted up. Barn weren't going to sheet up, Ren. So don't say thank you to Barney for sheeting up because he weren't going to do it. Yeah, cheer, Barn. Alright, it was myself. Thanks, mate. Thanks, mate. Yeah, look. Took that section out for us. We're going to insulate it. So we're going to insulate it. Cal's the apprentice today. Look, the two best looking lads are on oh, site. Yeah. Hey, 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 hey. Barn just fought. You have to do exactly the same up in the two locker rooms. Oh, why? They're both lava and plaster, aren't they? Because they're underneath the windows. <laughs> He's it's leaving. all lava and plaster up in the locker room. I just <laughs> haven't been doing nothing. I don't mind. I just thought that. You're a general builder, Barn. Right. Radiators are going on. Radiators. <laughs> <laughs> that was so enthusiastic. He had no enthusiasm. I was just lifting that. Just all that was off. 
<laughs> and he just lifted the rats. He's done all the Veloxes. He's been running around like oh, a blue where are we going, Cal? The windows. Where are they going? Uh, on the lean to outside. Jim, <laughs> they're going on Jimmy's, Jimmy's oh, little house. Oh, Jimmy's house. You're the labourer today, Cal. Oh, I am the labourer. Oh. I do the labour every day. That is true. Changing it up a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Bang on. That everyone's what? loving Would you no. believe the centre timber is centre? I'm loving the concept. Oh, not quite. Oh, what you meant it was something that you done, Bob? No, it wouldn't have been that. Oh, no, that's what I was thinking. Oh, that's oh, you're so is that line up? <laughs> well, let's just go centre of it, don't I? Oh, oh, mate. I had a good night's sleep. I had a whole four hours. You can bloody tell. Oh, I, I had a curry last night and all. Oh no. Beautiful it was. You're using the port. Yeah, port yeah. No, I used the one inside. <laughs> I ain't getting pushed over with that. Barley belly returns. Oh mate, it's worse than barley belly. This is deli belly. <laughs> Camera's on you today, Ethan. Oh, mate. mate, getting all the angles. <laughs> We just got the face for it. What was that, Barley? That was my version twerk. Of twerk. That's a white girl twerk, that is. I ain't got no booty. I don't feel like I've Cal, what do you think? Yeah, nice. Yeah? No, not like I've got no booty. I told you. If it was a... I don't know what to say. <laughs> you don't help yourself. What were you supposed to say? You to really me? don't. I don't know. You're all my ears are blasting. I, I call myself One Skin Jim. Because it's like taking a piss. It's a piss take out of blasters. We get in there and spend 100, 300, 400 metres a day and all they do is one skin. Yeah. And that's that was where the character was born from, one skin gym. Not much. It looks so easy. Mm. So I know, I know. Trying that little bit the other day is. That's is rendering. Difficult. This is worse than rendering. Yeah, I'll bet. I see it and I've done it before they all had my head. Oh really? Yeah. <laughs> that smells nice, that. Well, so smells like a match. Jesus. Not when you're breathing it in. Well, Barnes not moaning. I know, tell me about it. Don't you tell me. Bottom, mate. Oh, come on. Was that you, Cal? Yes, but the confusion here, it was like you had to turn around because it's only halfway through, so. It looks yeah, like it's it's been cut by a beaver. <laughs> <laughs> Wonders how to go at it. Oh, you won't sound that minute ago. Oh, camera oh, camera's on now, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Playing up. Oh. Making some more cakes, huh? Making another load of carbon cake. Brad's neighbours are nice. Yeah, she's lovely. She's well funny. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, that's nice. Quick progression up here, you did very well. Mate, you know me. Why have you not touched your tea, Bon? He's oh, busy, okay. mate. He's made one tea and he wants me to drink it straight away. What are you putting it? <laughs> Put a laxative in it. Don't, don't, please don't. <laughs> I need that. But if you don't want me, if you want to distract me from working, I'll drink the tea. What does it sound with cut? The ball builder cartoons. I'll have to draw myself on there, don't I? <laughs> Little level. Yeah, it's a little level, mate. It's like a plumber's best friend. And I lost it in the cavity. Yeah, I don't go to Wix a lot. To I mean, honest. you can if you want. Oh, okay. Thank you, mate. Um, we've just hit 287,000 followers on the Bull Grub Facebook Ooh, page. Ooh, that's a lot. 150,000 on TikTok that's in the last few days. Right, right, so it's growing. Yes, yeah, so that's flying. We're nearly on half a million. Well, it's it is flying. And if you don't follow us on there, it's at the Bull Grub on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. And got Go over there, and the, the, co the content is all varied. Are you do, I was just saying, you've done your tea in one then. Because no... you're moaning at me. Yeah, but you don't have to do it all in one. Now mate. I've got an old tea belly, you know. <laughs> and if you ain't learning, you ain't doing it right. Lovely job. Is that how it works, Carl? I know, I was just trying to register what you said. If you ain't learning, you ain't doing it right. You are a fantastic tea boy. Thanks, mate. I don't know anyone better. Really? No. Are they good teas? Lovely. Except for when you put sugar in it. Come on, mate, they're not all that big. You'll be all right. That's heavy, mate. Yeah, you can do the little ones. I'll do the little ones, yeah. <laughs>
And they've only got two, two sets of brackets on the little ones. So you just put it on the bottom bracket, work it on, then mark the top. You can always ask me, I'm here. Have we not got a re have we not got a plasterboard the others? No, it's oh. only up the top. Because oh. they're all um, I saw the rest are all on solid walls. I'll learn you. Nose is stuff. Are you gonna go do your own one? I am mate. No way. I'm fully trained now. Qualified. What, half an hour in the morning? Yeah, yeah you gave me a certificate out there, anything. The colleges will teach you it in three years. Yeah, but I'll you teach have... you it in ten minutes. Yeah. I'll learn you it. Qualified, I've learned so much. To be honest. Couldn't ask for a better boss. Ooh. I'm paying him this week, though. Oh. You're not paying him? Nah, so no. I'll, well, I'll t we'll do it on productivity, shall we? Mm hmm. So, what shall we say? I swept up. Hour? An hour? Well, to yeah. hang one round. Is that all we got to do? Put the screw, put the things on, the brackets on? Yeah. Oh. I don't know. Oh, here he goes. He's confident now, isn't he? Well, let me do one first. Right. Hold fire. Yeah, yeah, mate. All right. Then. You got tape? No. Got a level? Got a knife? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Level, tape, knife. Do you open the box? <laughs> See, I was needed him earlier and I was down there cleaning something up and typical apprentice, he's just gone without saying anything. And I'm asking, I'm asking questions. That's why I don't employ him anymore. I'd rather do it myself. He's got dropped and all, he's upset because he got dropped from the football team. No, he's, he's got to play for the six. <laughs> he's got to play for the six this week. <laughs> he couldn't play, he was really slow. He's not, play, he's not replaced me, is he? I think he has as well. I didn't get the answer to that one, but I think he has. Girls That's why I gave up football, I got fed up with rejection. <laughs> the, the DNA test has been done, Mark. What DNA and test? You're alive on your cut. <laughs> What are you trying to do? Make babies? Baby is <laughs> yours. <laughs> the woman just dropped it off. How's it going? All right. First yeah. coat, second coat done. That's two coats of blaster now. And now it's time to flatten in, they call this. And then the idea here is to flatten in them lines that you picked up on me earlier on. Use your lovely Hamilton little brush. You don't want to make this a modern house, because if you wanted to do that, I'd just buy a new build. Yeah, you want a little quirk. That's what this house is about, having little quirks and that. You know, no, he did, no, yes, he did. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. You said, I hope that bloke that came on ain't taken my place, because he was rubbish. Real. Oh, yeah, Becca would love that. It's a real fake, like a turkey <laughs> special. Yeah. Becca would love that. Do you want to try and see it? Oh, yeah, no. I'll, I'll give it a bit. Just a dust collector in it, won't it? Shoved anything. Because I know you made it. You can have that if you want. Well, it smells nice. <laughs> <laughs> Samuel? Yes, Ethan. I've um, I pulled you aside. Yes. Because uh, I just wanted to have to explain what's what. some questions about drills. Yeah. Okay. Please, can you explain what drill does what? Because I. So, this is quite common in the trade. This is an impact driver. Yep. This will deliver a thrust as it's rotating, so it's like a hammer. Mm. So it'll go, you'll hear them on site, they go do 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 do, because yeah. they're pushing it in as well as going forward. So that's an impact driver, that's for, put your raw plug in, you yeah. know, screw it, screw, or if you're screwing, screw into timber. That's mainly for screwing, but you wouldn't want to use that on like a kitchen cabinet or something that's a Delicate. little bit smaller, because it will right. round off, it will, it's powerful, that is. So that's what like scaffolders and yeah, they've got a different type. They've got an impact wrench. Um, that's more like a mechanics impact yeah. driver, you know, because it's got the big end. Mm -hmm. they're, they're similar, but they call them wrenches. Okay. This is a cordless drill. This has got the wrong bit in it. That's got that's an SDS drill bit. Okay. So, to tell what's an SDS and what's not, you see them grooves in it? Yep. That'll be for an SDS drill. You'd use something like this in a cordless. So it's just flat. Okay because you've got this thing here, this is the main difference between this and this. This has got a chuck. We call that a chuck. See that thing shutting? It closes up. And that closes up. So then you bang that in now. And then that's what you're gonna go through your wall with. Mm -hmm. So if you've got like a, a concrete wall on the wall and you can drill it, and then you've got different modes on here. You've got screw, which will screw. And then you've got 
that, which is screw, but hammer. So it will go doo -doo 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 -doo, okay. and it will screw and hammer. So it gives you a bit more power when you're going into concrete walls. This is really good to use for kitchen cabinets. So okay. you, cause you can change how, um, how fast it's spinning. See, a bit faster and then not as powerful. Right. So that's like for more delicate. Less talk. Less talk, more delicate work. Then you've got the big bad boy. This is called an SDS drill, which I showed you earlier. All you do is pull this head down. All drills are different, obviously. Find the groove, push it in, and right. it locks it in. With this one, you've got different couple of modes like you have with that. But this has got a hammer mode, which is literally just hammering. So it won't move, this won't spin. All right. So you'll put like a chisel bit on there, and that's how they get these grooves. Oh, I see. The chases, so they'll run yeah. the chaser up, and then they'll put their chisel bit in, do, 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 but it won't move, it just goes like a hammer. Right. And then obviously you can hammer and screw like you can with this drill, but obviously this has got a bit more torque. So if you're doing a, like a vent, like a four inch vent, and you've got to get through the wall and you've got a big old um, cutter and we ain't got one, then you'll use something a bit more powerful. I see. So that's a bit more powerful for you. Um, you a rear in the background. Yeah, f off, Brad. <laughs> we uh, heard you in the background a little bit having a bit of a domestic. We're having domestic, what are we buying? Uh, air off, Brad. Oh, that, oh yeah. <laughs> well, that's domestic. That's, that's how we talk to each other. That's, that is, that's, that's affection. Mate, you not, but you got that twisted, cos. That's my wife telling me she loves me. <laughs> f off, Brad. Oh, Brad! <laughs> phrase in this house. Oh, what's that? Begins with C. Uh, that's not a phrase. No, but it works. Okay, it works. Well, it is. If you, if you use it in the right place. If case, you say you, that's a phrase. Stop being And if I say to you, f off, you, that means I really, really love you. <laughs> yep, perfect. Yep, no worries. I'll just book it on the Tradeify app now. Yep. All right. Cheers, Martha. I'll send you the quote. Cheers, bye bye. That was Marta, she just wants me to do a price up a plastering job. So I'm gonna do it on Tradeify, the job management software. Basically, if you haven't already, download Tradeify, small to medium sized businesses, really, really easy to use. So simple, quoting, invoicing, and they've just dropped a new feature, which is estimates. So you can send someone an estimate. And also, last weekend, I got a message on Instagram saying someone has signed up, they forgot their password, and they were getting confused with to how to get through to support. I messaged Marta, who's the lady that we deal with from Tradeify, 11 o'clock at night on Saturday. By half 11, it was sorted on, the, on a Saturday. Their service is incredible, mate. Honestly, really, really good. Use code BALLBUILDERS, you get 50% off for the first three months, and you do get a 14 day free trial as well. Download Tradeify today. How do you make your lunch with it? You've done this. Wafer, cheese, yeah. cheese, ham, ham, wafer. And you get one at the end. Bang on, mate, on point to the maps. I'm oh, not... to the maps, oh, you maps. know it. Yeah, mate, I've done it a hundred times. <laughs> <laughs> I love them, bro. I'm looking at your game, and it's a timing game. How long would it take Ethan to make me and Sam cut coffee? Well, you've read my mind. I knew you were going. There's one. There's one. Good night, Percy. What? Good night, Percy. 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 Good Nice pair of reconstructed boobies because she had the implants out, and because she's got pregnant, they've gone bigger again. That's why. Yeah, it's not it. it's no, like Multi-talented. Feeding the dog now as well. Well done, mate. Well done. Well done. Well done. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's my lunch. <laughs> so yeah. Try out all that stuff. That's all on. That wall's on now. First coat. Gonna give that a second coat. Sam's gonna knock that up in a minute. Get wet at the moment. You've got to make sure with it. If you do a little bit of plaster indoors. Said you earlier on. If it's plasterboard, then you don't need to put no glue on it or anything. If it's plaster and you want to plaster over the top of it, then you've got to PVA it 50 50, so 50% ratio glue to water. If it's a shiny surface, like this fireplace was, this is called blue grit. You have to do it to cut the coats. The whole lot of that needs to be covered in that grit, all right? So you can see where it's patchy. I've got to give that another coat. 
So that's blue grit, ain't the cheapest stuff, comes in 10 litre tiles, and you've got to shine up tiles, you can plaster over tiles with it. Oh, okay. So if you had a bathroom that was tile and you just wanted to paint it, plaster and paint it, you blue grit the tiles, if that's solid, then you can skim over the top of that. Mm. Right, and it's all about control and suction. See like that, leave fingerprints now, look. It's too wet for the second coat. You want it to be just there, not turn for the second coat, but just about to go, and then you're ready for a second coat. Because if I go and put a coat on that now, all I'm gonna do is merge my first coat with my second coat and create fat marks. What's a fat mark? A fat mark is where the two coats have gone together and they're bled together and then it becomes one coat, one skim gym. Mm. It's not really a two coat job then. Let it go off just about right, then apply the second coat, and then when you're trailing up, you then push them together and then you trail up with them. While I get on with some more plastering, Ethan's got an idea. He just needs to know about the strap barney. It's called Keeping Up With The Boys, and right now I'm featuring a average looking chap called Barney. Barney plumber. <laughs> you know, I've got an apprentice somewhere, but a typical apprentice, he's gone walkabout. He's probably on his phone, sat in the loft or something. That's my cue. That is my opportunity to do his man. Barney, stupidly. Is left his van open. So, we are going to go do his seat. Mm. Go, Barney. Let's do that forward a little bit as well. That'll do it. Uh, I. <laughs> You don't need to know what I'm doing, Sam. No one's labelled anything, you know? No one wants to touch them, my bro. So they got... I've got to try and get the old wall back on, but leave the rads off. So the plumber doesn't know how to boil it. So I'm in a bit of a predicament, mate. I didn't know how that worked in 15 minutes. You come yeah. back. I know how it works because I'll cut everything off and the whole wall <laughs> won't work, and then I'll say, well, that's how that works. <laughs> or not. Yeah. Obviously, the radiator's down there. But the plasterboard, the vibrations, it was, do you see where the cracks are? Of course, that wasn't me, but take it back nice and neat so we can put a nice. Very nice, Calvin. That's it. Love the plaster. Take this wood down. There's a wood chuck chuck. If a wood chuck could chuck. What do I say? We've got a timer on screen. It's been two hours and we've only had a cup of tea since last time, then. If you were clever enough, you could have said that's because the water's turned on. <laughs> <laughs> but we have got a hose pipe outside for the moment. Yeah, yeah, so exactly. there's no excuse really for tea. Oh, no, exactly. Well, at least you know that. Like Calvin, some... the old sausage. Looks like someone's in your van, mate. I've seen what you did, mate, and it's not funny. I'm going to drive like I'm not like just to. <laughs> Just to <laughs> prove playing the game, yeah. Just to prove a point. I'm not one to be done, alright? Oh, <laughs> you done him a hard. I mean, you just pushed it forward. Why are you letting it out? I'm a bit of a big fella, mate. How am I supposed to drive like that? <laughs> Driving like Miss Daisy. <laughs> I can't wait for him to attempt to drive like that. Unk's painting is looking good, but now Calvin has something he wants to say. It, you know, though, if I did want to get a girlfriend, this is like when you yeah, know, like yeah. sad music, like on the X Factor, mm -hmm. to get through. If I, basically, there has to be a lady out there for me. Yeah. But gone are the days when they had to. I don't know because it sounds quite. I don't know if you're allowed to say stuff like that. Old fashioned, what? Old fashioned. No, no, no. I used to. My type then used to be big boobs, mm -hmm. like blonde hair. Yeah. And big lips. Right. <laughs> and as I got a bit older, I don't really care about looks. So, if there is any nice ladies out there, preferably like a farmer girl with mm -hmm. a few sheep and stuff like that. Yeah, I don't know, that's a bit weird, isn't it? Yeah, well, it's quite neat. Sheep, chickens, guinea pigs, anything. They're just, just a nice girl that wants to go on nice. Sheep and guinea pigs are, are very different. They, they yeah, but they're animals. Have Anyone very like a, different lifestyles. A girl that's got animals that mm -hmm. like dogs and everything like that, if you go on nice dog walks and they have nice weekends away and stuff like that. If there is anyone out there, then, uh, yeah, Hit up comment, man comment in the section below. Otherwise, I'm going to be lonely for the rest of my life. Yeah. Obviously, I'm 5'6", so I could do it with yeah. her being a bit smaller than me. I yeah. went on a date once, and I spoke to her online for a bit. This is the God's honest truth. I spoke to her for a while, 
organised both for a drink, knocked her, her actually, as I pulled up, she was like, you here? I said, yes. As she's come to the door, she was, her head was literally oh, touching no. the door frame, and I was like, no, I've committed. So anyway, I walked in there, we're walking down the road, and no words were like, she was up there. And I was just like, this is going to be so awkward. Walked into the pub, and just sat down. I couldn't sit down quick enough each side. Oh, but yeah, it was like a little large. How tall are you, like five four? Five six. I used to be five eight. And my feet used to be eight. My feet are now sevens, and I think I'm five foot six. So I'm getting, so I'm getting on a bit. But yeah, doing all this work with this carrying, it's shooting me down. Wearing your legs out, Cal. He is wearing my legs out, man. <laughs> How are we going in here, mate? We're all right, mate. Look. This is chill, this one mate, I bumped the bolt with it this morning. Bumped the big gauge this morning, then I said this one more to finish off. Mm, I'm gonna do that, now. actually I'm gonna do that Saturday hopefully. Well I'm gonna have that out tomorrow. So you just put me under pressure all the time, didn't you? Barnes having that out tomorrow so I can square all that up, timber frame it, square it all up, float it in and plaster it. So that'll look wicked next week. Oh, was part of you rather, this is a good one, would you rather eat a whole jar of peanut butter yeah. or a whole jar of matter baby? Peanut up. What's the matter, baby? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know. He didn't even care about this. Yeah. 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 As soon as you said peanut butter, I was like, I was like, I was picturing doing it naked at home, like fingers in it. Oh, no, 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 Baby. Yeah. No. You've never tried a matter baby? No. Where's the joke coming with it? Huh? Where's the joke coming with it? There's no joke. What's a matter baby? What's a matter baby? What's a matter baby? Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. 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 Y
It should say, where's Wally, but I lost the Wally. I've banned myself. Oh, that video bargain me or cow me. Have you seen it? Look at his belly. <laughs> look at his Wally. belly. Oh, look. Look at his belly. <laughs> <That's not fair>. <laughs> 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 he's having a, he's having a panic attack. He can't, he can't cuss you, bro, or me. You fuck it. <laughs> Have you seen the gap up there? On the video, Barney says, I thought you go football twice a week. <laughs> Have you seen the size of that little hole up there? <laughs> there was no way I was going in it. I used to have to do it as an apprentice. Wrap round like skirting. <laughs> I wouldn't have got in it. Did you think it was Barney touching your leg? Oh, man. Come on. Hey, ah. Every last bit of that you can pick up now. Oh, pick up your mum. <laughs> your mum. It's here. The mum jokes. Back out. <laughs> That's old school, mate. <laughs> it's hard not to laugh, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I'll pick your mum. I'll pick it up your mum. Is your, is your boy? The Macarena. No, it's your boy. Everyone knows who your weak spot is. You're nuts. So don't let anyone punch you in the nuts. Are you proud of that? Right now, innit? Look like a room now, yeah? Yeah, okay. Where's the shower? Shower goes here. Not that here. Toilet, basin, wall lights. And that's coming out tomorrow. And I'm going to plaster all that tomorrow. I'm going to square that up so it looks 100%. You know what, though? I just noticed Dave's got that fan in there, and I reckon that's too high. <coughs> Meaning, now you're gonna have to, that's gonna be a bastard for him. That's the four in, that's the fan. My clothing. Clothing, yeah, of course. I'm gonna call. check it now, but I think that's too high. That's a bastard though, because the hole's there. A fan, track the fan. Shit, let me have a look. Hole fire though. Hustle. Awesome. Awesome. You're yeah. just looking for that, and then it awesome. turned up. Yeah, so was. I was driving in front of that man. Behind. <laughs> oh, yeah, no. I was oh, in front of him. He was, he was following you, wasn't he? Hi, see. Yeah. <laughs> and then he pulled up outside. Look at that. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's actually an uh oh, isn't it? That's the uh oh because that's got a couple lower. Uh oh. So you've got insight there now. Feel it and everything. Yeah. Because what's going to happen is he's going to cut a new hole here. That's alright, because the wiring underneath it, so I'd be easier for No, the wire, yeah, the wiring is here, yeah. so he's alright, but he's got to cut a new hole. We can get around it, it's not a problem. He's alright, but now you've got to make good. I've got to make good. No. I've got to fill that up and make that right. He's going to say, that's where you draw it. I said, nah, bro, I'll draw it down here, cuz. Yeah, I saw that. And it? Yeah. I'll draw it lower. I got it on camera as well, I think. Because you measured it off Sorry, that. Dave. In it? Because I knew, bro, but I measured it off that. Sam! You just yeah, got to remember for the other bathroom as well. Do you like her? Show your dad. Dad, do you like her? Her delivery. That's nice. nice. Let's see if it's uh, father approved. Oh, yeah, because he has to. Yeah. Yeah. He didn't like the other one you bought, did he? That little doll post off, he says. <laughs> do you remember that? <laughs> dad, is that, is that approved? Yeah, can I have a t shirt underneath it, isn't it? Well, it's literally a jump. Yeah, that's right. Stop. You look good in them. Look at her shoulders. They're not, they're not approved. Yeah, so they're not. She's definitely going to find a new boyfriend at a gym, isn't she? That brand's there. Keep them ones in the bag. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> still here? Still beavering on, Unc. You still here? Yeah. Oh. I was just about to ask you the same. Oh. What was that? Probably Sage. Was that you banging the oh, windows? No, no, no. Did I? Yeah, it was that. I'll carry on, mate. You go home, see your wife. Do me a favour, though. Make her a nice cup of tea. Yeah. What? I'm telling you, Pat. Are you two yeah. telepathic? No joke, yeah. Me, her, and Sam, we think as one. We've been together so like so long, 24 hours a day. Me and her indoors, and me and Sam at work, and then he gets the vibe as well. He's like that Sam, what do you yeah. think I should do when I get home? Make a tea for your wife. What? <laughs> See the morning, Eve. See the morning. See the morning, mate. Eve, high five. That's what we do these days. Bye, boss. Bye, darling. Oi, Eve. What do you want? Let's have a cup of tea. You want having tea? 